First drill I'm gonna show you guys is a cone drill and we're gonna be focused on a one cut, kind of similar to a dead leg. All you're gonna need is a football field, backyard, wherever you can find some grass. We also gonna need cones. So if you do not have cones, you can use anything, socks, shoes, cups, anything you got to set up this drill. A lot of times you do this drill, a lot of people like to come to it cut around it, but we're kind of going to focus on that one cut. Obviously, first thing first is ball security. Make sure your ball security is straight. And when you get to the cone, the top of your body is kind of like you're selling a crossover, like you're taking a basketball and you're going right to left. But you're going to do it with ball security and you're just going to do it one cut. So you're going to go here, boom, boom, one cut, boom, boom, one cut, boom, boom, one cut, boom, boom, one, one cut, and always finish through like you're going to score a touchdown. The main focus is when you come in and you make that one cut, boom, you don't want to get too much lean over your body, you want to be too far back, or you're not going to be able to come out explosive. If you're coming here and you're coming through the hole and you got a safety coming down on an angle, and you want to sell him like this, boom, when you make the cut, you want to cut and explode out like you're going to score for another touchdown. Boom, 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 and snap it off real quick. Boom, 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 and snap it off real quick. For the next drill, we're gonna work on our jump cut and focus on staying low to the ground. Personally believe jump cut is probably one of the most important moves uh, that you should have in your tool belt. We're gonna start off in a running back stance and you wanna be able to take this step after you take the step, get to the bag, get nice and low, jump cut here, jump cut here, jump cut here, jump cut, always finish down the field like you're about to go score a touchdown. A common mistake people make during this drill, when they start in a stance, they like to take false steps to get going, but the most important thing to go forward, you have to take a step forward. You gotta get your momentum going downhill. You're going to the left. Your first step should be your left foot, boom. Another mistake a lot of people make, a lot of people make their jump cuts kind of high, and they go like that, cross behind their back. It's all about getting low, and you kind of want to overemphasize getting low in the drill, so when you actually go into the field, it's kind of second nature to you. You want to stay low to the ground, low to the ground, low to the ground. And that drill right there is a jump cut drill, very important drill for running backs. Take your time through it. Make sure you try to master it down and try to get better every single day. The next drill I have for you guys is a bag drill where we're gonna focus on high knees and quick feet, learning how to turn your shoulders and get vertical. For this drill, you're gonna need a coach. That coach could be your brother, your sister, your mom, your dad, or a friend. During this drill, you wanna focus on high knees. So we're gonna get high knees. You're gonna get a hit call. Load on this leg, go back with the high knees. And then when you get here, turn, get your shoulders vertical, and always give me a finish it somewhere and go score a touchdown. When you get through the bag, you always want to finish. Finish, finish, finish. I think that's what separates the backs in the league. The guys who can make that guy miss and take it to the house. And so far in my career, I feel like I've been doing that. And I think it starts here. I don't think, I know. It starts here in your training, starts here in finishing. And then when you get to practice, you got to finish the practice. And then when you get to the games, it translates. Last but not least is a ball security drill. Uh, what we say in the NFL, ball security is job security. It's the most important thing. Obviously, you need a ball, and you also need a partner. We're gonna be going for 10 yards. I'm gonna be running with the ball in my left hand. I'm gonna be stumbling and fake falling and playing my hand and continue to fight for the extra yards. But at the same time, making sure the ball is high and tight. And as I'm running, he's gonna be trying to punch the ball and rip the ball out. So he's gonna be punching for it. As he punches for it, I'll be falling, keep my balance, and keeping the ball high at the same time. A lot of times, the ball is fumbled when you're trying to fight for extra yards. So this drill, we're gonna focus on running and leaning and fighting for extra yards and not letting that ball come out of place. And that was the last drill, the ball security drill, the most important drill as a running back. We did four drills today. Hopefully I was helpful for you guys. Hopefully you guys learned something from me. Keep up the hard work, keep working, keep pushing yourself. Good things will come. Take care, y'all.